Hello, it's Shiley from Sheepishly Made in MCS Livestock. Um, today I wanted to show you what a uh, core wool is. So um, it is wool that we use for needle felting specifically. And um, it's a word you'll hear often when you are creating um, 3D felted objects, because that's when you'll use it. So to keep it short and sweet, um, core wool is what you use on the inside of your projects. So in this case, I have this needle felted gnome here and his body here, this little cylinder part, is mostly made up out of core wool. And then I add the colored wool on top. So there's a few different kinds of core wool um, and depending where you get it from, it can be completely different from um, what I use. So core wool, generally what you need is just a good, um, a decent quality fibers. A lot of times it is a little bit less um, quality than your um, nice wool you'll use on the outside of a project. Um, like this guy, I'm working on a rabbit here. Um, hi there, Michelle. Um, and this is the main body. I added a little bit of um, a wider wool on top of it, but it is completely made out of core wool so far. So this is what um, it looks like from the wool I use for core wool from our sheep. This is um, some of, well, I just call it a farm blend because we kind of throw whatever... Um, into a bag, sometimes some second cut, not second cuts, um, just the seconds from the fleeces, maybe a little bit more yellowish tinge to it. This is a little bit whiter, so you can see the difference there. Um, and I do use wool with VM in it because my sheep specifically, um, they get a lot of VM in them. Um, like my Hampshire crosses, uh, my more commercial meat breeds, they get more VM in them compared to my nice um, fiber sheep, like my Romneys um, and my Dorset crosses. Um, they actually, some of them um, shed the VM better. They kind of have a tighter um, fleece to them and the VM doesn't get in it as much. Um, but this is from our sheep. Now, I haven't had enough, so I've sourced some from the local mill here, Zeilinger Wool Mill. And they have a really nice um, roving I get. It's very comparable to my own, and it's actually a little bit cleaner too, which is nice. But um, you can find a lot of different kinds of core wool um, when you're looking to purchase some. And it's hard to decide what to get. Um, some people, I think, get scared of like the VM in wool. But for core wool, it really doesn't matter, honestly. It's not going to affect what you're doing. So in my opinion, um, as I've been needle felting for about five years now, this wool works really, really well. It's like a medium wool. Um, it felt very well. I've used needle felting and wet felting. Um, so hopefully in the future, I'll be able to have this available to sell just as the core wool. Um, right now I just don't have enough to keep up. I use it in my kits and that's about it at the moment. Um, but core wool, other than that, is just what you use on the inside of your objects. So if you have any questions about core wool, feel free to comment here on the video. And thank you for watching. Have a great rest of your day.